hello everyone i welcome you all for our new video that is based on the concept called linear differential equation of second order and higher order so in this particular video we will talk about the differential equations that are having a, an order of second and that can be exceed up to the fourth order right so if we talk about a differential equation a differential equation is an equation which is having a dependent variable suppose y is a dependent variable and it's depend on t means t is an independent variable then y of t is called y is a function of t and dy upon dt is called the first order derivative of y with respect to t right so this is the basic definition of a differential operator right now we will move forward for the second order differential equation so if there is a rate of change with respect to t in the first order differential operator dy upon dt then it is called second order differential equation differential uh, operator d2y upon dt2 right so similarly if we again have a rate of change with respect to t in d2y upon dt2 then it is called a third order differential operator right so as far as we make a change with respect to the independent variable t we get the higher order differential operator okay so after this we will move forward we will discuss about the standard differential equation that is of higher order differential equation that means nf order differential equation is defined by d and y dxn x is the independent variable here you can take t instead of x so it's depend on you you are taking x as independent or t as independent variable here i am taking x as independent variable plus a not d n minus 1 y d x n minus 1 plus a1 d n minus 2 y d n minus 2 y upon d x n minus 2 plus and so on and finally we will have okay so here we will have a uh let me correct an minus 
y that is equal to fx so this is a differential equation that is of nth order and non homogeneous because let me write first then i will make you understand why it is called non homogeneous this is a nth order non homogeneous differential equation so it is called the non homogeneous differential equation because we will have left hand side full of dependent variable and its derivatives right and the right hand side with full of independent variable or a function of independent variable a function of independent variable so this is the first phase of the differential equation now take the value of n 1 we will get the first order differential equation take the value of n is 2 then there will be a second order differential equation as well as the value of 3 and 4 will respectively give the differential equations of third and fourth order right so not wasting too much time we will go through the solution of second order of a differential equation right if we call this differential equation as equation number 1 so the solution of this equation 1 will be a combination of the solution that will be yx will be a combination of complementary function sorry let me correct it m i complementary function in short we will write it cf plus particular integration right so the our first our first target is to find out what is complementary function and what is particular integration so dear friends in next video we will study about the complementary function and the particular integration for now i will sign off this video so that you can get all these particular topics easily in next video we will get a deep study about complementary function how to get the complementary functions and what is the role of a complementary function in the solution of a differential equation till then goodbye see you later friends